But there's no time to dwell on his hangover. Philip needs to focus on his main course. Hello there. Morning. He'll be serving pan-fried red mullet. Red mullet is good news, uh, for me, anyway. I'm after red mullet. Um, I'm afraid I got my red mullet because of the bad weather. Oh, dear. Well, I'd go for the grey bream. I mean, that's not a bad substitute. Down, but not yet out. Phil is now cooking grey bream with... Grim... Gremolata. I don't know what gremolata is. It's an Italian concoction, Biggins, with parsley and garlic and a few shavings of lemon zest. That comes into a bowl. Mix all that together. He'll cover the fish in gremolata before pan-frying it later. Next up is Phil's starter, chicken liver pate. Oh, good. I'm looking forward to that. And I'm starving as well. I'm always so hungry with a hangover. Presumably he's make making the chicken liver pate from start. You presume correctly. We've got chicken livers. He puts 250 grams of butter and a clove of garlic in with the liver before adding some bacon. And this goes in the microwave for about three minutes. And then we just wait. Think about tonight, really. <laughs> well, I'm dreading this. Still having flashbacks. We had some mixed herbs, 150 ml of double cream. Looks like a heart attack waiting to happen. Anyway, it's now ready for blending. I shouldn't have done that. No. Then he puts it in the fridge to set. I think I'm done. You sure? <gasps> meringue. I've got the meringue to do. Which forms the yep. basis of his dessert. Eaten mess. A combination of meringue, fruit and cream. No problem with presentation on that one. I'm separating the egg whites for the meringue. Which he then whisks whilst adding caster sugar. With the meringue in the oven, he can focus on his own beautification. Is that girl's hairspray he's got on the shelf? <sighs> Finally, Phil's ready and he has an extra guest. We've got another one for dinner. You stay there, mate. Now he can relax. Ah! Oh. Uh, oh, spoke too soon. Uh, have I got time to change my shirt? I'm going to change my shirt. I don't believe it, man. The last hurdle. The diners are arriving, and first at the door is Edwina. Hello! How are we? Very well. Oh, I see we've got a fifth member of the crew tonight. Hello. Next, it's Biggins. Hello, Hello, my darling. How are you? How are we? How are you feeling? I'm fine. Yourself? I was ill. Were you ready? Oh, I'm not sure. And I, I, I haven't thrown up since I was a child. Interesting. So, uh, okay. cheers, my darling. Here we are. Hair of the dog. <laughs> Back again. I hope you're going to enjoy the wine I've got. I've got a nice selection. I don't really Julia, know Julia, you about have it. changed. <laughs> Here's the real thing. Hello. Hello. How are you? Mm. Nice Very to see well. you again. Hello. Lovely. Hello, Biggins. How are you? Are you all right, love? <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, nice and cuddly as usual. Enough <laughs> monkeying around. <laughs> Phil needs to explain his main course. Right, I went to go and get red mullet. Red mullet are slightly smaller, the sweeter ones, anyway. Right. Went there today, and because the weather's been cold, mm -hmm. the red mullet don't rise to the surface, so it's just catch of the day. So what is that? This is grey bream. It's... Oh, I hate grey bream. Oh, oh, you're joking. It's what it brings me out in a rash. You it said doesn't. that about the moose yesterday, <laughs> and I noticed you... Oh, don't Someone it. should slap him with it. Phil's starter has set and is ready to serve. Chicken liver pate with white toast and garnish. And he has some homemade Cumberland sauce on the side. If you want more sauce, there is more. But he's forgotten one vital ingredient. Wash your up, darling. Is there a glass of wine or not? Yes, sorry. Oh, I'm last time. <laughs> Good. Socially, I mean, you know, it's not right, is it? I mean, who asks for wine at a table? I mean, good call, thanks. I mean, you know. Well, I do, yes, because I desperately needed it. <laughs> How's that one? Sansa. Sansa, very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Good. Yeah, and it's, very well with the fish. Oh, it's a screw top. Oh, well, never mind. No, screw tops are acceptable these days. Are they? No, they are. Well, they, they are, are in this area. <laughs> <laughs> cheers. Cheers, 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 cheers. Cheers. Mm. You're doing very well. Mm -hmm. I thought that the uh, pate with the Cumberland sauce was delicious. Really, really nice. That pate was beautiful. He's worked at it really hard. 
and it tasted really, really nice. Jane, hey, what's that you're wiping off your shirt, darling? Oh, dear. <laughs> Better take that top off, then. <laughs> <laughs> off, uh -huh. off, 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 off. Keep it down, you lot. Now Phil has to prepare his main course, which he does by smothering the bream in the gremolata, then frying it quickly in a pan and putting it in the oven for 20 minutes. And it's done. Pan-fried grey bream with gremolata, mashed potato and a side of Greek salad. Straight off. Perfect. Look at that. That just comes straight off. Pomodori is wonderful. Mm. All good sounds. All oh, good yeah. Sounds. yeah. Silence is actually what you want, Philip, don't you think? Yeah. Thanks for filling it. More consonants than vowels. Mm, instead of O. Oh. <laughs> the main course was a bit overwhelming. <laughs> I think even Phil found it a bit bigger than he was expecting. But, in fact, the fish tasted lovely. If it had been half the size, it would have been acceptable. And, sadly, the mashed potato was cold. The but the conversation's yeah. hotting up. You've done a lot of work for Attitude magazine, have you? The gay magazine. Yeah. And they helped me promote the calendar and stuff like that as well, you know, so... Calendar? Have you got it here? Have you got a copy here? here? It's either the calendar or you're going to have to show some... Yeah. I can't get the calendar. <laughs> <laughs> Before we have food. Yeah. You have you done full frontal? <laughs> no, 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 no. Cut to the no. chase, why don't you? Have you done? Doing a show yeah, I've done many full frontals. <laughs> <laughs> but nobody would know. Nobody would know. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Ed Wiener. <laughs> From what I've seen of film tonight, he has hidden talents. I think he wants to show us, anyway. I think he wants uh, us to see this uh, gorgeous, minute little body he has. <laughs> You're making me sweat now. <laughs> <laughs> Better move on to your dessert, then. Philip takes his homemade meringue, breaks it into a bowl with a variety of berries, and then pours on double cream to make eaten mess with strawberry puree on the side. Lovely fruit. The hard part's now over. Happy. Happy boy now. Mm. Happy, happy, happy. <laughs> got one more thing to do. Yes, absolutely. Oh, calendar. Have we got to get it? You've got yeah. to go down to get the calendar. calendar, yeah. And before you can say, I just happen to have three with me. Come on then, Phil. Yeah. 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 There's one we got one each. Wow. Can we keep one? You can keep Woo. them. No. That's wow. Oh, they're lovely. Look at that. we should do is we should all decide Which... what's our favourite month. OK, OK, OK. <laughs> I'm liking January. It's very nice in the black and white. Stop looking at that part. What, your head? <laughs> <laughs> should we try and reproduce that in the shower now? <laughs> <laughs> I've got my, my little camera. <laughs> Do you want me to rub the baby all on? I mean, somebody's oh, doing it. What's happened to you tonight? Yeah. Of course, what we could do yeah. is we could take him over there yeah. and yeah. sit on him. Yes. Yeah. We'll take him no, he might yeah. like that, though. He might like that. Yeah. He has... I think Edwina wants to see the colour version, yeah. Phil. Oh, 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 oh. We don't want you to lap dance. Yeah. We just want to see your chest, that's all. No! Go on! No. Go on! No! no. 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 Before so. She became a woman possessed, Edwina, ripping his clothes off him. Oh, boy. Go on, go on, go on. <laughs> you missed it, Edwina. You'd seen the calendar. I thought, let's see the real thing. What a fantastic thing to be able to pull out at the end of a dinner party. My black and white calendar shots. I thought it was absolutely fantastic. And the scores? That was a pretty good evening. Um, both for effort and for the results, I'm going to give Phil an eight. And if he'd taken his shirt off, it would have been in double digits. He did really well, and I'm going to give him uh, an eight. Food was great. It was well executed. Um, it was nicely presented. It was an adventurous uh, menu as well. I think Phil Olive, my mate, deserves a seven. Which puts Philip in the lead with a grand total of 23. Not that he gives a monkeys about that at the moment. I'm so glad that's over. Man, that was the hardest day's work of my life.